What you are looking at is pretty plain to see, right? It's a rubber broom with a squeegee. It's got a 57 inch long extendable handle and it comes with this little handheld version as well. It's cool, right? Okay, but you don't really understand how cool this is until you see it in action. But first, I'll show you another little feature. If you want to use this just as like a regular floor mop, it does come with those little pinchy hole things to hold in whatever microfiber cloth or maybe disposable um, towel you want to attach there. Look at the density of these rubber tines, teeth, I'm not sure what to call them. The grip on the handles is nice and rubberized, and you can also hang this up for convenience. The density and the length of these rubber teeth really does make a difference. First, I'm going to vacuum, and my vacuum, it's a good vacuum. This is my front entry hallway. It is covered in dog hair and stuff coming in from the outside, cat hair. Okay, let's get to it. I Remember, I did vacuum this in advance with a good vacuum. Do you see, with just a few swipes of this, what I'm picking up? What? That is all pet hair. Gross, but satisfying, but gross, right? I'm telling you, your carpet has this stuff living beneath it, and it's the density of those rubber teeth that make all the difference in collecting this up. I'm just gonna do a little bit more for you so you can see exactly how much this picks up after vacuuming, after vacuuming. This is again a highly trafficked area, so this carpet has seen better days. It's not the fluffiest anymore, so stuff tends to kind of get packed down into it, but this device, this rubber broom starts to revive it a little. I honestly couldn't keep up with the amount of traffic that this carpet received until I started using this in conjunction with my vacuum. So seriously, check this out. It is super satisfying. You can see how much extra pet hair, and I have one cat and one dog, if you can see how much extra this picks up after I vacuum, can you imagine what it does beforehand? Now, I do recommend you vacuum your space before you use this on it, just to take care of that top layer of grit and hair, but I don't know. Try this out. I would love to hear what you think about it, but this is one of my favorite cleaning products ever.